Did your dad leave you? Are you emotionally scarred? Do you have like deep rooted issues because he left? Some may call it daddy issues. Do you have a sense of uh, emptiness always in you? A void? No? Okay, well that makes one of us. <sighs> Hi. This video is just a little bit uh, different. I'm pretty sure nobody is on YouTube looking up like how to dress up as your absent father for Halloween, but here we are. Here's the video, you're watching it, this is it. Just a little disclaimer. I'm not actually emotionally scarred. Probably deep down I am, like maybe potentially, I don't completely know. You know, for all of us who are in the absent father community, some of us don't like to talk about it. And then the other some of us, which is uh, me, who like to joke about it and think it's really funny. We have no other type of sense of humor, so we rely on dad jokes. Some people might be caught off guard. Some people might find it uncomfortable. You just have to make a joke out of it. You know, I could have been something cute for Halloween this year. Last year I was Kim Possible. Could have been like Mac DeMarco or something, or like dress up as a tampon. I don't know. But here I am um, choosing to be my dad. If you're watching this dad, hi, it's been a while. How are you doing? No, I'm just kidding. I don't care. Please click off of the video. Truly, this entire costume can be done very last minute. All the other accessories you can find around your house, probably, most likely, maybe, I can't promise you that. If you just have a Halloween party tonight, go as your dad. Or, if you're watching this after Halloween, just dress up as your dad sometimes, you know? It just kind of like fills up that empty feeling in your heart a little bit. At least it does for me whenever I do it. Let's get started into, you know, transforming into your absent father. Okay. Excuse my nakedness. You're gonna wanna get a morph suit. A black morph suit represents the darkness, the void. Uh, kind of like a missing character from a video game. It, it represents your dad. I got this for like 20 bucks off of Amazon. Not my size, not very flattering, but it works. I'm also out of breath because uh, I just ran up the stairs. Something that I never do, but you know, when you're just like such a fitness role model nowadays, you just <sighs> gotta start running up steps and whatever. Um, I've come to the consensus that I look like a Teletubby. The crotch area is very down low. Not, you know, very form-fitting, but I'm pretty sure that my father didn't wear very form-fitting clothes. I mean, maybe he did. I, I don't know. My butt kind of looks nice in it. I don't want to put on the head just yet. Not because I'm claustrophobic or anything, but... Yeah, that's really it. That's the only reason I don't want to put it on. So, you want to get a sign, you know, that says missing father. You want something to replicate something real, something that you would see if someone was actually missing. As you can see, it reads, last seen 10 years ago, leaving to go buy some milk. So, what is the stereotype of, you know, most missing fathers? Um, they either went out for a pack of cigarettes or they went out for a gallon of milk. I don't know if my dad was a smoker, so we're gonna say that he went out for a gallon of milk. You see, I do have a regular gallon of milk. It's 1%. Oh, it's 2018. A lot of people are going vegan. Rumor has it that my dad is somewhere in California, and if he's in California, he's definitely a vegan. We're just gonna completely scrap that empty, you know, low-fat 1% milk and we're just gonna empty out my already perfectly fine almond milk and we're gonna use that instead, so. So now it's time for accessories. So, you know, we have our sign and that somehow needs to be attached to us. So, uh, you know, the most effective way would probably just be to staple it. 
the sign is now attached to me. Now everyone knows that you are now your absent father. So our last final accessory would have to be the milk, obviously. Um, so, you know, from my knowledge and the pictures that I've seen, my father was extra. What better way than to add a flashy belt along to your milk carton? Now, this milk carton represents the milk that he went out for 10 years ago, so. Perfect. So now our last step is to simply just, you know, um, become our father and also go through claustrophobia for a second, but it'll all be fine. And there you have it, folks. Now, if you don't want to dress up as this for Halloween because you're afraid of offending someone, that's completely understandable. Um, but I'm doing it anyway. Just doing a quick OOTD here. Actually, this tripod is a tripod that my dad left behind 10 years ago when I found it in the attic. Funny. Thanks for watching, everyone. Um, if you like this video, please subscribe, like it, comment. Um, comment if your dad left, you know? Just something that we can all relate on, like as a community or something like that, you know? Sorry, dad, if you're watching this, not really. Where's my mom's child support? This probably isn't the content that you asked for or that you needed. Thanks for watching. Yeah, there's nothing really else I have to say. Okay, bye.